In this video, I want to introduce you to clamping your workpiece. When it's time to add clamps to your fixtures, there's three things to consider. Where should I place the clamp? What type or style of clamp do I need? And should I download the clamp or should I create a new clamp specific to this application? The function of the clamp is to securely hold the workpiece against the locators. Ideally, the clamps are placed exactly opposite the locators. And it is the locators that resist the cutting forces, not the clamps. Ideally, clamps are used to hold the workpiece down. It's best to avoid excessive clamp force against locators and excessive force which can distort the part. A minimum of two clamps must always be used for milling fixtures to prevent rotational tendencies. In order to determine the clamps required, we first need to determine the clamping force. This will then allow us to choose an appropriate size bolt or hydraulic clamp and the number of clamps required. For smaller drill jigs, hand clamps are often the best choice as speed is important and they can be very quick. Strap clamps are well suited for milling operations with larger cutting forces. Edge clamps are typically used when the top of the part must be kept clear for machining. To summarize, Ideally, clamps are placed exactly opposite the locators. They must force the part into the locators. They must be strong enough to resist the cutting forces, but not distort the part or move the locator over time. And a minimum, two clamps are always required when milling to resist the rotational tendencies of 